I'm talking about uh, speaker's topic is knowing word time using a tool a voice typing which is uh, useful tools uh, as a basic one I'm talking about speaker's topic. This is knowing all the time is my topic. Before I mention about, I'm a member of Toastmasters Club, which is named as Korea Carpellium Toastmasters Club. I can join because the Toastmas Club is on June and online. <coughs> Normally, the Toastmas Clubs that were, is held uh, in Busan. I attended it <coughs> four times, uh, became a guest and also I became a ice break speaker and our counter and table topping master. Following uh, April 5, I will be a speaker who can speak with one topic for six uh, or seven minutes. Speaking rule is very strict. I should not use unnecessary words like or uh, mm, you know something like that. And also I speak properly use sentence and also with a good topic. Speaking is evaluated by evaluator and also our counter time checker timer and they measure they uh, check out what the speaker speak properly so speaking should be well organized for time and with topic in grammar so I need to prepare how to speak and what to speak with my topics. Knowing all time is my interesting part. I've been uh, studying about the group, the earth, and the nighttime and daytime and time zone, including geography. Knowing all time is very useful. So I decided to choose this topic as a speaking topic. Hello Toastmasters and fellow Toastmasters. I would like to talk about knowing world time. 
Now, um, because of uh, COVID-19, which is spread uh, worldwide uh, in the pandemic, people cannot gather concerning about uh, COVID-19. So, we started uh, Zoom here online using the internet. By doing that, many club members here from other countries are available, possible. So we meet many people here, including Korea, USA, Malaysia, Turkey, and other place. So, when we meet, we are wonder what time there is. And so, I would like to talk about knowing more time easily using geography with the GPS. Geography is a very important part to know worldwide and the earth. As you know, the earth um, occupied by human beings as well as other creatures. Only human beings have countries. Maybe ruled by other creatures to ruled by the human being. Geography problems consist of more than 120 countries and also many cities, oceans. So we know about geography. When you name about the famous place in your country or the capital city, big mountain, the river, and then we can know about big port, we can know about where it is. You can name. Uh, if you live in Malaysia, we know about uh, Malaysia, Borneo, um, also Kuala Lumpur. So, and if you uh, live in small city, I uh, live in small city like uh, Te'an. You don't know about uh, Te'an. So I can clue, give you clue. Um, Te'an is uh, located 200 kilometers away from Seoul, the west side of Korea. Te'an is peninsular. You can see, you can imagine, can you imagine the map of Korea. This starting is uh, knowing uh, geography is uh, mapping and in your head, map drawing your um, map and then you can figure out where you, exactly you are. Then we know about GPS. GPS of time is very simple because the Earth is a global. Global means uh, consists of many many circle. As you know, the circle have a degrees. The circle degrees three hundred sixty degrees. So and if the Earth rotate to one time, we call this is rotation. And we know. That means uh, 24 hours. We call it one day. It's simple. So it's the same one day, 24 hours, day and night, 360 degree. Also, it's the same. In fact, the meaning of uh, to Earth is uh, not the time. Is that degrees, 360 degrees. So, one hour 
is 15 degrees. So we know about uh, 15 degrees, part of 15 degrees. So how far is 15 degrees? It depends on where you are, but we think about uh, equator, 15 degrees almost One thousand six hundred fifty kilometers is quite long. In terms of Korea, we have only three degrees. Three degrees uh, from uh, west to east. Far from the China, maybe. Um, we have uh, uh, 10 degree or more 20 degrees so we have a time zone the each time zone is 16 six, 15 degrees so we know about 15 degrees and knowing about time if your time and you are in the morning and east side is already morning and daytime west side is still night time or at night so when we can figure out the time we know about the time because now I, I now have 11 a.m. here that means uh, the east side uh, already 12 or 1 p.m. or 2 p.m. or 3 p.m. and maybe um, the other side of uh, my country like uh, um, Uruguay, Arantia and that means uh, 11 p.m. and the west side is uh, like China 10 a.m. or uh, Vietnam um, 9 a.m. Malaysia is same, almost same, and 9 a.m. or um, 8 a.m. And morning time, even the far is like Turkey, the London, England, uh, that means uh, 2 a.m. It's still at midnight. We know about time. So, my question, my suggestion, uh, when you meet people online or calling you can ask them what time is there you don't have to asking the time just only you asking about where are you ah you are in korea or oh, where are you you are in malaysia and ah the time you are there is a, a 9 a.m right then People say, how do you know that? Uh, I know, I know you and uh, a little more about Malaysia. This is uh, connection with uh, living together. So, and then we can figure out using geography and with the GPS. Now, uh, join about my um, calculation we uh, know about the time in the world so um, you can use the chat room uh, name the city I can name the time using geography and with the GPS information if uh, I don't know about the information I can ask you uh, where is located as geography and the GPS is uh, right then and I know what time is there the time is very very exact things so and then we know about the time very well uh, not difficult so and then my suggestion today talking knowing what time and don't ask what time is there just asking where you are oh then and where is the location you can figure out 
where the place and you can use the mathematic how divide par and then for example where you are I'm in India or India or I'm in New Delhi and then ah oh, New Delhi is almost 90 east 90 I live in 126 almost um, 40 45 that means uh, 45 means uh, three three time distance that means India to Korea three time now 11 a.m. so ah so you have uh, 8 a.m. so and then now 8 a.m. now ah that is you uh, in the morning you, when you figure out the time and the latitude is one more I would like to topic and then more detail about daytime uh, and nighttime distance ah you can now see uh, rising sun or ah you already uh, having morning did you have breakfast and then drinking tea or something and we know about the life cycle with the friends and I like this we can understand more without talking and it's some information and then we know about their life learning about all geography in the globe our world is very simple so we can do knowing don't ask what time there asking uh, just your name ah your time is morning uh, what's the morning like uh, do you have sun today now we have sun but uh, windy uh, is there wind out there so what do we do today and then and we are talking more comfortably and you also ask me don't ask oh, what time here just name about the time and then so what's my life and then where you are and then what the weather like it's something like that this is a uh, topic knowing world time is very simple you can understand